So I'm going to write out a number, and then we're going to think about how we could say or actually write that number. So I'm just going to write it out. I'm going to have to resist the temptation to actually speak it out, because that's normally how I operate, but I'm not going to do that right now. I'm not going to do that right now. So there's several ways that we can pronounce this. I encourage you to pause it and try to pronounce it yourself. You might not even need to pause it. Well, the first thing that jumps out, well, we've got 20,000 and then some, so maybe we should write it that way. So we've got, we've got 20,000, 20, actually, let me write it out as numbers first to really decompose it. So we have 20,000, and then what do we have on top of that? Well, we have 5 tenths. This is the tenths place, so we could literally write that as 5 tenths. 5 tenths, then we have 0, 0 hundredths. I'll write that as a hundredths place just so that we can keep track of it. And then finally, we have 7 thousandths. That's the thousandths place. So we could write that plus 7 thousandths. So if we were to write down everything I just that I just spoke out loud, we would say that this is 20, let me write that a little bit neater. This is 20,000 20, and 5 tenths and 5, let me write out the word, and 5 tenths and 7 thousandths and 7 thousandths. Now, this isn't the only way to say this. Another way of thinking about it is to try to merge the five tenths and the seven thousandths in terms of thousandths. So let's think about this. So we could write this as, so once again, we would have our 20,000. 20, but instead of five tenths and seven thousandths, let's write our five tenths in terms of thousandths. And the easiest way to do it is to multiply the numerator and the denominator both here by 100. So then we will have, so this five tenths is the same thing as 500 over 1,000. And the seven tenths. Is, or the seven thousandths is still seven thousandths. And these two combined are 507 over 1,000. 507 over 1,000. So we could just call this 20,000 and 507 thousandths. So let's write that down. So we could just say this is 20,000, 20,000, and, and, five, Hundred and seven, five hundred and seven thousandths, 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 thousandths. This is one over a thousand, while this right over here, a thousand, of course, actually represents one thousand. So we got twenty thousands. That's that right over there, and five hundred seven thousandths.